again. Welcome back to another video. Look at this, guys. Something exciting. Look at this box. So, this is Madame Glam into the nude 2023 limited edition. Hello, glamorous. A nude manicure is a beautiful way to accentuate your natural beauty. <laughs> I love these new boxes. So, the Into the Nude box contains an exclusive selection of three full-size semi-sheer nude soak-off gels with a smooth application and a streak-free finish. So, let's get into it. So, this is on the website now. This is available now. And don't forget, guys, I've got a 30% off code for Madame Glam as well. It'll all be in my description box. Let's have a look at this. Oh, my gosh. Look at these bottles. So, these are new bottles. I don't think these are new bottles. Um, I think it's just for this collection. Oh, wow. These are fancy. Right, so this one is called Magnifique. They are still 15 mil. Let's have a look. Right, so these are semi-sheer. Oh, that's a pretty colour. It's like a nude pink, isn't it? I'm going to give these a quick swatch anyway. Then we've got Blush Rush. Oh, this is a brighter pink. It's like a baby pink, isn't it? I'd call that a Barbie pink. Again, it's a little bit sheer. And the Bliss. Oh, so this has got a bit of a peach tone to it. Very pretty. Right, let's get these swatched. And I'm going to do a set of nails to today. Because it is Madame Glam's ninth anniversary. So it's been nine years ago since they were uh, established. So Madame Glam has asked us to create some birthday slash anniversary nails. So that's what we're going to do today, and I think I might use one of these. Let's get them swatched first, and then I can decide if one of these is going to work as my base colour. Right, let's start with Magnifique. Let's bring you in just a little bit more now. Yeah, so these are slightly sheer. They are supposed to be like that, which I do love. Especially when you're doing simple things like a French manicure. These semi semi sheer colours, they give you that look like you're wearing acrylic or hard gel. They just have that slight, slight transparency. I love that. I love that colour as well. Nice, nice nude pink, isn't it? Beautiful. Right, let's do blush rush. This is a very nice pink. Proper Barbie pink, isn't it? Oh, that's really pretty. I will give them all two coats, but I'll show you first what they all look like with one coat. And then we've got the Bliss. That's a nice colour as well. Very nice. Right, so that's what they look like with just one coat. They're really, really nice, aren't they? Really nice. I really like them. I like them a lot. I think I might use this one today, I'm not sure. Right, I'm going to give them a quick second coat and then I'll be back. Right, guys, that is them swatched. They are beautiful, beautiful colours, aren't they? I love this one. I love this one a lot. So that's them after two coats. So that's Magnifique, Magnifique, Blush Rush and The Bliss. I like all three of them. So, shall we get on and do some nails? I love this box as well. So let's leave this one out. Right guys, so I've pulled some tips out and I'm using one of those nudes, Magnifique. And I'm just going to give all these tips just... Two, two thin coats using this. I'll just show you doing a couple of the tips on the first coat and a couple of the tips on the second coat. I actually shouldn't have painted the middle one. That was supposed to be white. You'll see me switch it out for a minute. <laughs> so that's what they look like after the first coat. I love this colour. And so this is the second coat now. That's going to get a 30 seconds cure as well.
Right, so I'm using Madame Glam's Perfect White and I want to paint um, French tips, French, yeah, French tips on two of these. So I'm just using the Madame Glam Long Fine Liner Brush. I love this brush for nail beds, it's fantastic. So I'm just painting the outline of the smile line and then I'm just going to paint in them little corners and then I'll use the brush out the bottle to do the free edge. You only need one coat as well with this white. The coverage on this white from Madame Glam is fantastic. There is not a white out there that beats it. There really isn't, I love it. And this is where I've swapped out that middle nail. Um, this needed to be a full cover of white. So that's going to get a cure in the lamp. I do give this um, two coats. Right, guys, I've made myself some fancy pants little decals. So it's a Madame Glam bottle and it says established 2014 and some teeny tiny little itty bitty ones. So I'm going to cut. Uh, this smallest one out that's going to go on the middle nail and I'm going to put some of these teeny tiny ones on the French tip ones so I've cut them all out look at the size of them <laughs> and I decided to use foil gel this is Madame Glam's foil gel that came in the Christmas calendar just a nice thin coat of that and I'm using that for my decals because they are homemade they don't stick down as well as shop bought ones so I used foil gel just to give me something really sticky to put them onto. So I've put that bottle decal face down on my stamper and I'm just letting the water soak in and then just slide the back off just like a regular decal. There's not much difference. And then I'm just going to press that straight down onto that tacky surface right in the middle. These were so cute. I was so happy with how these little decals turned out. Look at that. <laughs> Right, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get that sealed in with a top coat first. I was scared of it peeling up because my decals, they do dry out quite quickly and peel up. So I've got that sealed in straight away. And exactly the same on these little French, French tip nails. I'm going to put all them teeny tiny little bottles exactly the same way. I've just done that big one, except these are teeny tiny. And I'm going to stick a few. I'll, I'll just show you doing this one nail. I'm going to put them all on the stamper in one go and just peel off one at a time and stick them down. Right, so that's all my decals stuck down, aren't they cute? So I've pulled out a couple of colours to match. So that Rodeo Drive matches the pink. Celestial Jungle kind of matches that greeny one. And I've pulled out a blue as well called Fresh Water. Look at that Celestial Jungle, isn't that a gorgeous colour? Right, I'm painting three balloons. I've just used a dotting tool to get it round initially. And then I'm using that brush and just bringing it into a little bit of a point so it's more in the shape of a balloon. And then just sticking that little flicky bit where you tie your knot on your balloon. I've just added that little flicky bit. And then I'm going to do a blue one next to it, exactly the same. And I'm going to stick them in the lamp and I'm going to do a, a pink one. I think I did the pink one off camera. I did the pink one kind of over the top of these two in the middle. So, because it's their ninth anniversary, I thought I would use their silver chrome paint and I'm just going to write number nine in the middle of all these balloons. I'll just show you doing this one. All three of them are going to be the same. So, 
So there we go. That's all three balloons got the letter. No, it's not a letter. It's a number. Number nine. So I'm just going to add some little strings to the bottom of these balloons. Join them all up. Right, and lastly guys, I wanted these to be matte. I thought they'd look quite smart done in matte. So I've just gave them all a quick matte top coat. And I'm going to also go around these smile lines quickly using that same silver chrome. Right, and I've pulled out some rhinestones. These are the rainbow rhinestones I got off Temu. If I remember, I'll leave the link below. £1.99 it was for all them rhinestones. So I've picked out pink, yellow and blue to match the balloons kind of thing. And I'm just going to do a little strip of rhinestones up the middle. And using that same silver chrome, I'm just going to stick a line coming out the bottom of the rhinestones and out the top of the rhinestones. And then I've added a few little caviar beads in between all my rhinestones as well. So there we go guys, that is then finished. Quick, cute, fun kind of set isn't it? For Madame Glam's ninth birthday slash anniversary. <laughs> right so guys, I will leave the link below to this Into the Nude, into the nude kit. There's the colours again quickly. They are available on the website now. Don't forget you can get 30% off using my code. It'll all be in my description box. I'm pretty sure this is a little contest Modern Glamour doing where viewers get to vote on their favourite set. I'm not sure, but I will keep you all updated. Please remember to give the video a quick thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. And hopefully, I'll see you all in my next one. Take care, bye.